The safety valve opens at a preset pressure to prevent the compressor tank from overpressurizing. If the pressure switch malfunctions, the compressor might not turn off once the tank is fully pressurized. In this case, the safety valve will open to release the excess pressure in the tank. Over time, the spring in the safety valve can weaken, causing the valve to open at a lower pressure than it should. Debris can foul the valve, causing it to leak. Replacing the safety valve is a repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. Hi. I'm Mark Soja. Do-it-yourself repairs like these are easier than you might think. From lawn machines to cordless grills, kitchen mixers, outdoor grills, our how-to videos walk you through each repair from start to finish. So doing it yourself means never having to do it alone. Let's get started. Before you begin any repairs on your air compressor, you'll want to be sure to drain the air from the tank. Let's get started. I'll begin by removing the gauge shroud. With the shroud removed, now I have access to the safety valve. To remove it, first I'll remove the ring that allows you to open the valve with your finger. Now I can get a socket wrench onto it. And I'll go ahead and unthread it from the manifold. Now I can install the new safety valve. Again, I'll remove the ring. Thread it onto the manifold. And tighten it with the socket wrench. The safety valve comes with thread sealant pre-installed. And I'll reinstall the ring. And now I can reinstall the gauge shroud. And now you know how to install a new safety valve on your air compressor. Be sure to check back often for new videos and expert advice. If you found this video helpful, give us a thumbs up and leave a comment.